Good afternoon, everybody. I have a car. A nice one. I'm fucking tired. I'm just going to go around it real quick. Um, I just literally got back to Bill's house with this car. Um, it was a whole, listen, all morning adventure. It's three in the afternoon, almost four. I'm just now getting back to the house. We left at nine this morning. Um, this is it. It took a while to find something that I really wanted to put money into. Um, something that I felt was worth putting money into. Something that was me. Um, something that I felt um, that I wasn't embarrassed to drive. So uh, I'll show you guys. It is a Focus. It is a Focus. It is front wheel drive. Um, it needs a little bit of work. It is a five speed. It has full tinted windows. It's got a little bit of surface rust. Um, the rockers aren't that bad. I need to replace the rockers. Um, you know, clean up the doors and stuff, the fenders. Um, you know, it needs some plastic pieces here and there. Um, it needs some trim pieces. But it is, it's clean, man. It's, it's fully clean. It's, it's clean. And it's a five speed and it's got something special under the hood. So, which I'll show you guys. This is why I bought it. Um, very, very special car. Rare, rare car, actually. You don't see them like this. It's got a Borla exhaust system on it. Um, full, full cat back exhaust, Borla all the way back. Um, it's got an Eaton blower on it. So, um, I'll show you. Which it needs, it needs new hoses. It needs to be gone through. It, it leaks a little oil. It needs a new starter. Um, it needs love. Um, the person that owned it definitely, uh, they, I'm, I'm pretty sure they bought it from somebody that put it together, um, that, you know, knew what they were doing and, uh, was taking care of it. And, uh, they drove it and it was too much for them. I really believe that's what happened. It was too much power, too fast for them. Um, but this is it. It is a, a Ford Racing, uh, supercharged motor. So, it's got the Eaton blower on it. I have no idea anything about it yet. I don't even know what I have fully yet. Um, I'm about to find out. I know a little bit about these. Um, I'm going to be knowing everything about these. Um, but it does have a supercharger. It does run. Um, obviously, I drove it here. It drives just fine. Uh, I just finally started opening it up a little bit. And I started driving better. I was driving behind my uncle, uh, trying to tell my uncle to go. Like he, he's driving like a grandpa. This car is not made to drive like that. The car you got to open up. As soon as I opened it up, and uh, started, you know, letting it breathe and stuff, um, it started running good. So I haven't really been. I haven't done much. I haven't listen. I haven't driven this car on the freeway either. I haven't. I popped the hood. I drove it for a minute. I tracked the oil. Everything, I, everything checked out. I said, just give the man the money. We got to go. Um, I knew what I was getting. And uh, the, the people that, uh, that had the car, they were good people. They had a beautiful home. Um, they weren't out to get nobody. You know what I mean? They were literally looking to, you know, come up with a little bit of money for what they needed the money for. And they were willing to justify the loss. Um, therefore, I, I got something worth value which i explain to people all the time is in order to get ahead in, in in business you have to understand value and what i paid for this car and what it's worth it was justifiable to spend the money without fully knowing what it is i have so um the car i could list relist this car right now easily for 3500 4500 and if I did a little bit of work to it, I would get that for it um, if I cleaned it up. So that's the problem. That's how I got the good deal, too, was the person didn't want it going bad. And it's starting. It was any longer the car sitting, nobody taking care of it, driving it. It would start falling apart. It would start. It wouldn't be worth fixing. They knew that. So they were therefore they were willing to let it go and let someone have it. And they didn't want nobody just having it. Um, they didn't want no teenager buying this car or something. Some kid out of high school buying this car, killing himself. Because it's really squirrely. It's front wheel drive, you know, and you're pushing, you know, I'm pushing. 
The gauge says I was pushing about five. I, I've only hit about five pounds of boost so far. Um, she backfires, she pops. For sure. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to, you know, we'll do some videos on it. I'll go through it. So if I got to... I got to check all the hoses, you know, I got to zip tie these down, that type of shit, all that stuff. So go through it. I got to charge up my battery. I want to, I'm going to probably pick up an optimum battery. I want to change out the air filter. I'm probably going to get a real actual box, you know, replace this with something good, something actually worth looking at. That's cheap as cheap as you can get, you know, um, the car was definitely, it, listen, the car is worth, worth every penny what I paid for it. So, but yeah, it does need new rockers. It's got Toyos on it. Yeah, Toyo Proxies, which are my favorite wheels. One of my favorite. They're the best bang for your buck for the most part. I don't know about these rims. Torin, I don't know, I never, never heard of them. They look nice though, Toyo Proxies 4. They got a little curb rash. Um, we're probably gonna be putting a nice bright kit in it. I gotta, I gotta sand these down, get these clear. Um, you know, there's a lot of stuff we gotta do to it. I gotta fix her up. It's gotta get a radio, a sound system. I'm gonna be changing out the seats. The seats are getting changed out, all that stuff. The car is getting full custom. All the stuff will be getting removed, you know. <laughs> right, it's got a little up, up, little upside. It's funny. I love this thing, man. It's, I had to have it. And yes, it does have a real Borla exhaust on it. It's a real Borla exhaust system. For sure. She sounds good, man. I'm going to be getting replaced in the rear bar, everything. I'm going to get some springs for it, all that stuff. Some coils for it, all that stuff. So, um, she'll be nice. She, uh, she drives nice already. So I'll talk to you guys later. I'm going to go get some rust. Peace out.